What is up guys? So the lesson on my mind today was just something that I've kind of come to notice about myself often. Um, it's something that whenever I do execute upon it, it always, I shouldn't say always, but 90% of the time it works out extremely well and extremely effectively. And when I don't execute upon it, there's just this blind spot. And so what I'm talking about is the ability to execute and take action despite the unknown. So walking into the unknown, not knowing what's gonna happen, but still doing regardless. There's just so many times where you kind of, I, I would get nervous or scared or I'm not sure exactly what'll happen. Like as of now, I'm still in California. Coming to California in itself was the unknown. I've never been to California. I do not like taking planes, not because I'm scared of planes, um, I'm just, it's not really a fear. I just don't like the hassle that comes with taking a plane, like booking the flight, getting the luggage, getting to the plane, getting back from the plane, getting the hotel, all that stuff. It's just a hassle. I don't prefer to, I don't like to do it. Um, the plane itself is fine. I don't mind planes. I do hate long flights because I, I just don't like sitting still, but that's beside the, uh, beside the point. Coming out here though was a huge step into the unknown. I had no idea what to expect. I had no idea if this would be somewhat of a, like a scam or if I would just be losing my money, if I'm just wasting my time, if there was something else that I could have done better, if I would even get anything out of it, whether it's because the information was so overwhelming or if it's just because it's stuff that I already knew, I wasn't sure, you know, it was a true step into the unknown. But the lesson that I did learn is that it worked out. It was a great experience, probably one of my favorite experiences of all time so far, and it will probably be one of my favorite experiences throughout life. And I do not say that lightly. I, I truly mean that. Um, but yeah, that's the kind of lesson I want to share in this video that sometimes taking that step into the unknown and not being sure what will happen, but still being willing to move regardless is extremely vital, extremely useful. It opens you up to so many different things. I don't think I've had too many times where I've stepped into the unknown and not had a good result out of it. Even if directly speaking, the thing that happened wasn't great. Like for example, say you wanna to talk to a girl and she rejects you. The rejection sucks, but it builds a muscle inside of you and it helps you do it more. It's almost like your, your mind gets calloused or you step into the gym for the first time and you're just scared. Lots of big dudes in there lifting heavy weight. You don't really know what you're doing. You don't know how to, you don't know how to do the workout. You're afraid you're gonna like break a bone or hurt yourself or tear something or even just be judged, which I think people are probably more afraid of than physically being hurt. I think they're more afraid of being judged. Doing that in itself, even if you don't do the workout effectively, even if you don't come out looking like Arnold the very first time you go into that gym, you've made progress and you've built up that muscle that lets you, it's good feedback. It lets you know that you can do this, that you are able to just go forward and execute on whatever it is that you want to do. So that's the lesson that I wanted to share with you in this video. Um, as always, let me know what you think about it. If you like the video, please like the video, hit the like button. Um, please comment. I love to hear feedback. I love to know what you liked about the video, what you didn't like about the video, what you'd like me to do videos about and what I can do to change myself and my future content. Um, and of course, if you like the video, share it. That always helps. That always helps support the channel. Um, but otherwise, hope you enjoy your day. Take care. I love you.